Hello comic book community, me back here again with them. Part 2 of my June catch up, I'm with the second half of my Marvel here. Bear with me two seconds. Oh, I can't reach. Oh, there we go. Alright. So, here we have The Invincible Iron Man 518, The Long Way Down Part 3. Again, I believe this was another of the titles that they were dropping, if I remember rightly. I'm not too concerned about this. I've been enjoying reading it for the most part, but I'm not heartbroken if they do get rid of it completely. <clears throat> and issue 519, Long Way Down Part 4. Then we have Journey into Mystery, 396, nope, that's completely wrong, <laughs> 639, sorry, no idea where that came from. Then we have 640, that is a really nice colour, I really do like that. Then on to another of the titles that Marvel is dropping. I was actually a little bit a little bit disappointed that they were dropping this. The table is creaking. What fun. So yeah, that's the Mighty Thor issue 15. And issue 16. I actually really like that cover, I think that's quite cool. And we have the Mighty Thor Annual. Be the first and I guess the only annual for this series. Silver Surfer on there. I love the Silver Surfer. I need to um, pick up a few, few more issues with the Silver Surfer in. I've got very little Silver Surfer in my collection. It's something I've been meaning to sort out. And here we have... Um, New Mutants 43, part 5 of 5 of the um, the Exiled crossover event. Tell you what, I'll be back in two seconds. I'll go and grab the other four issues of this. They all join together to make one big um, panoramic image. So, see you in two seconds. And I'm back. That was some effort trying to find those. Should have thought of that beforehand. My fault. My bad. Right, so... Here we go, let me just stand up. This is the exiled one shot that started all off. Then Journey into Mystery 637. Let me line them up a little bit. Then New Mutants 42. Get them lined up. And Journey into Mystery 638. Those four make up the majority of the, um, the picture there. New Mutants 43. The only thing that really seems to line up is um, a boot down the bottom here. <laughs> oh yeah, that's, um, I thought I'd just show you that quickly. So if I can step back at all in the picture. There we go. Get these back out the way. And on with the show. Alright, next up from Marvel we have The Punisher, issue 12. This is another of the series that I'm actually enjoying quite a bit. He is just a very, very angry man. And we're on to Scarlet Spider. Another one I'm actually enjoying quite a bit. 
That's issue six there. Then, part one of the Spider-Man miniseries. The most amazing heroes of two worlds. That's part one there. And then we have part two. I actually quite like how they've done this colour. Then on to Uncanny X-Men. Issue 13. I believe again this was another one of the titles that Marvel were dropping, if I remember rightly. I have to say, I'm not actually um, surprised about that. I had a feeling going into the whole Avengers vs X-Men thing that either Uncanny X-Men or um, Wolverine and the X-Men, I had a feeling one of the two titles would be dropped at the end of the whole um, conclusion to all this this, this, this that's going on right now. So it'll be interesting to see if it is actually anything to do with that. So. And, um, is that in order? Yes. <laughs> Uncanny X-Men issue 14. Then we have Venom issue 19. Savage Six, Savage Six part 2. And Wolverine the X-Men, issue 11. And last but not least from Marvel, another Wolverine and the X-Men, issue 12. So yeah, that's all from Marvel over the last month. I will... Um, Again, I'll call this part two, just so these videos don't drag on too long. And I will see you shortly for part three, which will be my DC pickups. Hello, convict community. Me back here again with part two of my June catch-up. Ouch.